Now, China is using artillery to fight its drought. Weather officials fired rockets and shells filled with cloud seeding chemicals into the sky. Chinese authorities hope to create a little bit of rain, easing the worst drought they've seen in decades. Emily Chang has the story. Well, this is China's worst drought in half a century. It's been a long dry winter and national forecasters saying the next weeks and months could be just as dry. Some areas getting 80 percent less rainfall than they normally do. More than four million people and two million livestock are facing water shortages. The crop that's most seriously affected is China's winter wheat crop. This drought is hitting almost half of China's winter wheat fields and rice crops are also having some trouble. The problem is that Many farms in China still rely heavily on rainfall to water their crops. Irrigation systems are poor. So over the weekend, China brought out the big guns, literally rockets loaded with cloud seeding chemicals, fire those chemicals into the clouds to make it rain. But those clouds are thin and moving out of the drought stricken area. So that's only going to be a short term fix. Over the longer term, the government plans to divert water from its two longest rivers, the Yangtze River and the Yellow River two drought stricken areas but it's still going to be very difficult to get water to farms in mountainous areas in remote areas that desperately need it uh, chinese premier wen jiabao went to one of the worst hit areas in hunan province over the week in an attempt by the chinese government to assure farmers that officials are taking this drought very seriously and to boost confidence now the central government has allocated almost 13 billion dollars to drought stricken areas officials ordering that this money get to farmers as soon as possible so they can buy tools, fertilizer, things they need to salvage their crops and get them through this dry spell. Emily Chang, CNN, Beijing.